Hey there friends, thanks for checking in. Today we're looking at the new Rex Delta. I've been excited about the Delta for a while now, even prior to SHOT Show when Eric's Arms floated pictures out there talking about their new polymer frame striker fire handgun with a four inch barrel called the Delta. Get a load of that grip. It has a great look and feel to it, and, and that's what excited me when I was at SHOT. I said, you know, this is not your average Wonder 9. It just feels and looks different that, that just seems to fit me. Now, it does come with additional back straps, three additional back straps in the case, and this one here. This, this fits my average size hands pretty well. It also comes with a 15 round and a 17 round with the plus two base plate uh, magazine. So both orange followers, nice, nice capacity, and a trigger with a trigger bar safety in there that I measure right between six and a quarter and six and a half pounds. So there's your initial pull and then reset right there. Short reset for the follow-up shots. And I, 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 I like it, it's just a smooth trigger. Now, it is an ambi gun, so here you have your magazine release and slide stop on the left and right side of the gun. So that will make lefties happy, that's for sure. And it does have front serrations. Blacked out rear sights, serrated black rear sights and a front dot. It also has a loaded chamber indicator bar right there that will pop up when a, loud, when a round is loaded. And it also has a striker fire indicator. So you can see it does have a red dot when the slide is not charged, that dot goes away. Accessory rail there, it does have some serrations on the front of the trigger guard and underneath. And all in all, I just like the way this feels. I like that, that grit right there, a memory bump right there for the weak side thumb. It feels like a quality made, compact size striker fire 9mm. And it's actually a bit lighter as well. I measured it up with the Glock 19 and it's about just under two ounces lighter both unloaded and loaded with 15 rounds so let's take a look at this compared to a couple other handguns let's start with the glock 19 since i already mentioned that and here's what we're looking at here now eric's arm says that this will fit a glock 19 holster so we're going to try that right now okay you can see both four inch barrels that's what we're looking at there it's a it's a thinner grip doesn't feel as blocky and here is the holster I had for the Glock 19 and you can see that yep it does fit in there and I wore it around for a little bit and you know it, it's just fine doesn't have that snap that many of the uh, the holsters have when uh, when it's custom fit to a certain gun but here we have an MP 2.0 all right, once again, four inch barrel, so we don't expect to see any great difference there. All right, just giving you a little visual of what you can expect with the Rex Delta, both 15 rounds. And then here we have a Walther PPQ. All right, now each one of these that I held, my my feel, my just my my average feel tells me that the Delta is is a little bit lighter. So we'll 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 check that out as well. And then here we have. The grip, both uh, holding 15 rounds there. So let's get the delta on the scale here. We'll put a mag in. Whoop, my mag's in already. All right, so we have the 15 round mag in. The loaded weight is, or unloaded weight, one pound, six ounces. And we're looking at the unloaded weight of 22 ounces. So where's that Glock 19? Let's throw this on here. Everybody knows. See, that's unloaded too. All right, so we got, all right, back to 21 and 7 eighths, let's say 22, and over here we're looking at 24. So it's two ounces lighter than the Glock 19, and then we'll get a, a loaded weight on this before we close this thing out. I want to show you how it disassembles because this is unique, it's cool, I like it, and here's what we're looking at. You're going to go ahead and pull the trigger, move the slide back a bit, and take you know, depress these takedown levers, and then at this point, all you have to do is move it forward and off, just like that. And there goes the, the slide off of the frame. There's the frame, very light once again. 
captured recoil spring and guide rod and here is your four inch barrel and there's your uh, slide couldn't be easier reassemble is just as simple we'll go ahead and put this back and then what you're gonna do here is you're gonna just put it on the slide just like that or you're gonna, you're gonna put the slide on the frame and then pull back on it and there you go nice all-around firearm I'm happy to have it guys I, I tell you I'm I'm actually really thrilled I can't wait to get this to the range I have a feeling it's gonna be a great shooter it, it feels good I think it looks super cool I do like the way the mags are it does have that little lip under there so you can rip it out if you get some debris in there nice all-around handgun and I think this is gonna perform excellent at the range I do have uh, some good experience with Eric's arms firearms and this Delta is going to measure up I'm pretty sure with the Rex 01 in its own class if you like videos like this please subscribe and share I always appreciate thumbs up button thanks for watching and you guys be safe